Ah. Ah, clear air for a change. That's nice. It's nice and bright and sunny and... Ah, that's a good hopeful sign for heading back to Skyrim. Just gotta empty stuff out at this place they gave me for storing stuff, which is very nice of them. Still not sure I want to make a permanent home here. It's nice and out of the way, all things considered. Maybe once I get the TARDIS back and it's playing along nicer, I'll be able to come back and forth as I please. That'd be nice. With the Aspawn threat mm -hmm. taken care of, I can give my men the rest they deserve. Ah. Well done, friend. You're welcome. Is it really those ash spawn down in the tunnels are giving him trouble? Oh well. Uh, hey. Any luck tracking down Esmond? Yeah, he's dead. Freakling's got him. But here's the formula. I told him not to head up there. Sounds like the bloody fool got what he deserved. Uh -huh. Here, I want you to take this key. Huh? Head inside my house and unlock the door in the basement. Help yourself to whatever right. you like inside. I won't be using it anymore. Okay. Well, I guess I'll go down there and see what there is to Bring your take. weapons and armor to me. I'll fix it up right. Sure thing. Sure things. Sure thing. thing. Ooh. Phoebe Gildy. Very, very nice. Some armor... Letter? My dearest daughter, Sapphire? Have me heart that I write this letter for her. I tell this and some night. You know, after I join the band, I said, it's your day. I can't sleep at night for a big farm. She wasn't even frightened. She saw me think we were both falling in love. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. And it's burned to the ground. Everyone was either dead or gone, including you. I feel pushed by Ben, y'all. Forget to look at my eyes. Spitting image of your mother. And... What do I do with this? What do I do with this letter? I mean, he said I was welcome to anything in here. Somehow I don't think he meant. A letter meant for his daughter. Sapphire? His daughter? I don't even know what to do with this. I mean, on the one hand, taking it is is very much a, would probably I don't I, 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 a breach of. Ooh, this is some very nice armor. Um, hey, um, you got about a good this, thing uh, going here now that you've reopened the mines. Don't let it go to waste. Never mind. Never mind. Letter. What about this letter? I mean, if I deliver the letter, then... Then I'm... Oh, bloody hell. You don't make things easy for me, do you, Nocturnal? Debella, Akatosh... Talos, whoever, Neloth, I don't even know who to talk to about this. Mara? Is it Mara who's doing this? This seems like something Mara would do. Place a letter in front of someone and tell them to deliver it to, to the recipient without actually telling them to deliver it to the recipient. You know, I mean, it's, it's basically a self-given request to put the letter in the rightful hands. So, yeah, that seems like something Mara would definitely do. Right. Mara. Huh. Freaking dumb. I don't even know how to deal with 
this. I mean, she deserves a right to know, doesn't she? She does, I think. So, what? Am I breaching his trust by delivering the letter? I, I don't even know. <sighs> well, store these spider pods and these amethysts at least. And uh, now I know nobody can use the spider pods. Considering I took them all and burned. the dragon bones, and the dishes, and the gears. But it still doesn't give me anything else to do besides tell her. I, I gotta tell her. I gotta give her the letter. And that, I'm heading back to Skyrim anyway, so I might as well give it to her. Yeah, I'll do it deliver the letter. Even though nobody's asked me to, it's just the right thing to do. Deliver the letter. Wipe away the guilt. I'm just gonna leave that book there. Ooh, more coin purses. Well, it's forfeit. Because they tried to kill me. That's how the world works, isn't it? Store some stuff in here. 